Hey guys, Tater here, and welcome back to another video. In this one, I'm going to kind of show you uh, more of like a, a scope script. This is mainly for like a challenge for a parkour or something. But as you can see, I've got this black room right in front of me. I've got a start door and an end door, and like you can see a black block there. The reason why the room is black is because there's actually script blocks that are black, so that you can't see them. <clears throat> black is like the only one that works here. But if I turn on the script, Wherever I look, if there's a script block, it'll change its color for a second. And you pretty much use that as like a, kind of like a see in, see in the dark script. You could use this for like a, what I'm using it for is a self scope in my Pokemon map. And I got a castle running the script. You could make one, a script that cancels it when they leave or something, but to do this script is very easy. Uh, you're going to need two scripts. I have three for a different color, but you're going to need one for the script block. This changes it black, which you do set texture relative 000, and then the number 10, it's because the 10th uh, the texture in the block is black. Or it's not black, it's the gray color that I switch it to. And then it waits two seconds, set power off, and it changes the texture of that block back to uh, what the block was, which is black. So 9 is black, 10 is gray. <clears throat> As you can see from the textures right here. The ninth one is black, the 10th is gray. That's the script for when it's powered on and you keep it as a pressure plate that way when they're standing on it it kind of works. And then the next script you're going to need is the one that turns it on. And for that one it's pretty much just set power one block in front of you, two blocks in front of you, three. I did it to range eight and then I did the same thing but to the right one and all the way up to the 8 in front of you and then to the left one 8 in front of you and then up one and then down one so it pretty much just takes the 3x3 three three square in front of you of up one left one and then up and left one and then the opposite corner and it turns all that on that's all it does and then it waits half a second and loops so with that looping it turns on the stuff in front of you with the script being it changes the color so when it's on it changes to black for two seconds turns off so that's really all this script is and it's really easy to do and set up and thanks for watching and hopefully this script has good uses for you guys